YouTube, it is me, TRXCW, here recording, um, whatever it was, our Let's Play episode 25, I believe, and, um, yeah, so, let me find it, oh, there it is, yeah, I hope you enjoyed my last video, um, my playthrough of the Night of Terraria. That is a really fun map. All four of them. There's three stories and four maps. So yeah, that's really good. So hope you enjoyed that if you watched that. And let's just go do stuff. I don't know. I'm gonna put away my money. I feel like exploring the corruption today. So we're gonna be As always, I'm trying to get more, uh, more, uh, ores for my armor and stuff. Yep, okay, um, so, me, Enderman Killer, Fire Meets TNT, and JWD301 are all going to be do getting on a server that I'm going to create for Terraria the movie. You might have seen Paperback VG's Terraria the movie, where he just does a Let's Play and stuff, and you might have seen other things where it's just people playing for an hour or something, but we're making an actual movie with a point. Um, it's going to be like a storyline sort of movie. It's going to be a story about a war between these two teams. I'm not going to give you too many details, but it's going to be uh, two teams. One team is going to be me and JWD301, and the other team is going to be Farmies TNT and Enderman Killer. And we're just going to have a war, and there's going to be all sorts of rules and stuff, but that's all I'm going to tell you. But it's going to be really fun, and it should be coming out as soon as we get a time arranged to record. I will be recording for the blue team, and Enderman Killer will be recording for his team. That was a lot of words. I got something, actually. That's all I'll need. Probably, maybe, ish. So yeah, um, another thing, Terraria Mythbusters, I really want to do that, so please send in any myths you have about Terraria. I'll also do a Minecraft Mythbusters if I have to, send in myths and stuff. But I really want to do Terraria Mythbusters for 1.1.2. Okay. Okay, that was my awesome background. If you saw it, I'll give you another preview. Okay. There's your preview. If you haven't seen it already in my other videos, I think it's in my carrot video. I don't know. But if you haven't seen it, that was a preview. go to Hawaii. I think we're gonna create some sort of like paradise part with like a pool. Not on this, but I'll, I'm gonna make it and show it to y'all whenever I make my paradise or whatever. It'll, I'll make like a giant ocean thingy, artificial ocean, and I'll make an island in the center. It'll be epic. I wanna expand the ocean a whole lot and then make an island in it at the, at the other end. That's one thing it should have. It should have an island in the middle, just a small island with like a little grass and one tree or something. But that would be something, that would be awesome. And rain. Just 
just trying to find the corruption. I can't remember if there's any on this side or not. I know there's some on the other side, so I'm gonna go there, but I'm not completely sure about over there. I don't remember anything. Oh yeah, there was, because the jungle's over there. Oh, I was so close to the corruption, but I forgot there was some. I teleported back. Dang it. Why did I plant saplings there? Does anybody like these parts, this tunnel part where it has that on top? I just like to remove it because it looks so much better. But that would take an entire episode and that would bore y'all to tears. So I'm not going to do that. Check out my new cursor. I edited my cursor so it's white so I can see it easily when I'm in places. Like if you have red cursor, which I think is the default, it's sort of... It, it can get hard to see in some places, but with the white you can see it everywhere stuff. It seems to change to gray when it's in the sky, white when it's underground, and uh, cross between both of them, but I don't know if that's... I, that might just be the colors and the light and stuff, but that is cool. I'm gonna wave it around. You can see it too. Yeah. There's my cave. There is another cave over there. I remember. Remember where I built that small little hut thingy. There. I remember that there is another cave over there. So that's another cave to explore. And I think it's got a decent amount of stuff in it. Doesn't this like just end or something? Oh well. That's for another time. Gotta get corruption. Finding the corruption is harder than it would seem. Do you like the volume the music's at? You can still hear me talking and but you can hear the music also, which I like. That's what I like in videos. I think Fire Meets TNT doesn't do the music. Finally, Corruption. So, as I was saying, Fire Meets TNT doesn't do the music, but I sort of like the music. I'm gonna explore down here. This is very dangerous. So do not, whatever you do, do not try this at home. Do it somewhere else. Oh yeah, epic grappling hook. Okay, that's a good pit right there. That'll get me down there. Gotta get some worm food. Come here, eater souls. I forgot how I got that. Demon eye. I don't remember. Didn't Enderman Killer give it to me or something? Oh well. I think Enderman Killer gave it to me. We have a pit. Going down to a shadow orb. That's the deepest pit I've ever seen. Yep, right down to a shadow orb. Let's smash it. Anybody when they first encountered corruption? And like you wanted to make your house out of stone, did you ever think the ebon stone was stone? Yeah, I, when I first began the game, I made my house completely out of stone. And when I saw it, wait, can't I mine ebon stone? Oh yeah, I can't. But um, when I first saw the ebon stone, I was like, ooh, a musket. I was like, oh. Stone and a lot of it finally, but I couldn't mine it with my coffee pickaxe. I'm like, no, this must be different stone. And I saw that was up in stone when I finally was able to mine it. Who thinks shadow armor and 
Cobalt armor and hollowed armor look the best. Me. Anybody? Okay, well, write in the comments if you think shadow armor, hollowed armor, and corrupt armor look the best. Otherwise, if you don't, otherwise, if you think something, some other armor looks the best. Oh, did you know? I'm kidding. Um, write that in the comments, and I'll see how that looks too. Okay, that was fairly decent throw. I feel like smashing two of these shadow orbs. Or meteorite balls, as Fire Meets TNT likes to call them. Orb of Light! Yes! How much man does it take? 40? Come on, but I did get a musket. 41 musket balls. Oh man, I really should have bought more corruption powder or whatever it's called. But then the Eater of Worlds would have spawned when I smashed his third shadow. <laughs> Get. And the arm stealer is here already for some reason. I forgot why. Oh, yeah, because of Lacey 3781. I'm surprised no NPCs have taken my room. I'm gonna go buy some musket balls from him. I'm not gonna buy that many because I'm gonna save up for the mini shark. Oh, there are only seven copper. I'm gonna buy 250 of them. I thought they were 75 copper. <laughs> Gotta get some more mana so I can use the orb of light. There we go. There we go. That works. How many fallen stars do I even have? No, not that. That. Hmm. <sighs> Need blocks. Stone. going to make it I'm, I'm gonna move I'm gonna make this an NPC village I'm going to make my own house somewhere else it's gonna be awesome what is that again clothing oh yeah I stuck a hook in clothing because I felt like it ha 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 Go make vile powder. I'm gonna have a lot of vile powder. Then I'll be able to fight EOW. Because vile powder is a weapon against him. In case you didn't know that. Who's flash? <laughs> Dang it. I only have 11 of them. I'm just going to be holding those and stuff. That 
this fast. Oh darn it, I forgot to start my timer to see how long I was recording. Oh well. Did I just get Skyped? No. <sighs> Sounded like I just got Skyped. Yeah, this is my flattened area. I don't want to see that house. But otherwise everything's going to be in there. I'm going to connect the two. One, two, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Should be 230 left after I finish the floor. Yep. So I'm going to get about, let me see here, minus 4. So I'm going to get 16 room. 16 blocks of room. Because of my 2 wall thick. It's just going to, it's not going to be too big. I think I might move my craft, some of my crafting stuff. Make new crafting stuff. I do have to gray, make gray brick wall. It's gonna be two floors and a roof. So let me see here. One. Five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, one, two. Okay, so these are going to be the middle two. I'm gonna move the workbench right below them. I was close. I was pretty close. I'm gonna move the workbench right below them. Take them out, replace it with platforms. Where are my platforms? There they are. Should I do platforms in the middle? I don't really want to do platforms in the middle. That's what I always do. I'm doing platforms on the side. There we go. I'm gonna do the torches. Like that. Up in the corners. Booyah. Glow stick. It's just going to be my small, humble house. I'm going to like it better than the other house. Because there won't be any NPCs living in it. Too much space taken up. I'm 
One. So these are the middle two. I'm standing on them. Now nothing's gonna be up there. It's just gonna be thank you to Enderman Killer for this house idea. They're sort of the same floor, man. Not really, but sort of. Gotta make a skylight. Can't even make a furnace. Let's go make a furnace. And some gray brick wall. I should have made. Yes, a meteorite has landed. Check that out, Fire Meets TNT. A meteorite has landed. I'm going to get some meteorite armor soon. This should be enough for now. No. There we go. That should be good for now. And glass, and glass, and glass. Glass wall is always good. There's no such thing as not enough glass wall. And a sawmill. No, not a sawmill. Yes, a sawmill. And an anvil. And that'll be it. Okay, that's all I'm gonna have for the crafting. how you make a sawmill. Yep, workbench. Okay. On my uh, original world, it took me like so long to make a sawmill. It took me like, I don't know, a month or so in game. No, it took me like a month or so in reality. I'm serious. It took me way too long to make a blasted sawmill. I like was never looking for iron. I love building, so I was always working at my house. But some of the things I had to build required a sawmill. I'm like, no, no stupid sawmill. I just want to craft. Arg! And it wouldn't let me because I wouldn't build a sawmill. So I had to go out and get iron and stuff. This video is going to be called new house and corruption. Now I've got to figure out where to put the windows. Like that. I'm going to make three windows per floor. It's going to be like that. There we go. Um, just kidding. No. I don't know why I said just kidding. Because I have the song Just Kidding, Just Being a Kid stuck in my head. Why do I always have a song stuck in my head whenever I record? Just call me maybe. Just kidding. All sorts of crud. Oh yeah, I do have a furnace and stuff. I'm gonna put the, all that stuff up in my attic. Boom, it fits perfectly. 
there's going to be a, a no not an anvil. What was I saying? Furnace on every floor. That's my crafting area. Skylight. Can I get to the workbench? Okay, if I remove this sawmill, can I craft still? Yes. Thank you, Lord. Bone Star! No! Well, I don't know if I'm going to put a furnace on the first floor, but there will definitely be a furnace on, in my bedroom. Darn it! I forgot what my guide's name is. Isn't it Lucas or something? Wasn't my guide's name a ri Oh no, I remember. Remember in the very first episode, the um, first world I created that I couldn't do anything with? Because it was like, I couldn't explore too far away from the spawn and stuff. And it was all hilly and I couldn't find a flat part. That was where the guide's name was Lucas. I thought the guide's name on here was Lucas. Oh yeah, check it, 12, and I was correct in Mundo. I have an idea. Use up most of this. Tiki torches. The reason my house is so well lit? Windows! But here we go, mugs. Four of them. For specific reasons. Why can't I place it? Oh, does it have to be on a table? Really? Yep, it has to be on the table. Guess I can make bottles. Should I can make... Oh, wait, there we go. Yeah, I got it. I'm gonna make a double alchemy station, but I can't. Lost. Ugh. Can't do anything with that. I'm gonna make a table. 
table and chairs and stuff. Oh, I got an idea. Oh no, I did this. stuff. Now all I need is a furnace. And then I can move all my stuff in. One second. Oh yeah, furnace is down at the bottom. I'm gonna make an armor statue in a second, but I've got Oh yeah, you can't set torches on platforms. There we go, that sort of looks like a chimney. But I don't really care. sort of looks like a chimney. Whatever it does. Whatever gets the job done. There we go. That's what my dad always says. I think. I can't remember exactly if my dad actually says that anymore. Now the platforms make it look weird. So right after I put my bed in and stuff, I'm gonna end the episode. Hammer, ban, hammer, ha 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 ha. Ban you, ban you. Is the demolitionist living in my room or something? No. Okay. I'm gonna make that into something later.
gonna make that into a simple room. <laughs> right after I make an armor statue. Just put my stuff away. Yeah. Don't have that many blocks, surprisingly. I know, I know, my thing's open. Oh yeah, that looks awesome. Dresser at the foot. No, wait, dresser at the head. This is going to look awesome. Dresser. Furnace. Workbench. Nah, I don't need a workbench. And piggy bank. Banner. I'm gonna make some more banners. Darn it. I know. Moving the torches. I'm gonna go make a couple. Uh, one more banner. Wait, no. Three more. Oh, what else? is almost done guys guys and gals gonna move my torch will this restrict the movement of the door yes This can be fixed, I hope. There we go. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Okay, that looks so awesome. Just gonna trash those. Uh, organize my stuff a little. Watching me build my new house. It's just a cozy little cottage thingy. And it has a roof. And stuff. Okay. I'll see you next time. Bye. 